Now, from the Sports Blitz studio, Ashley Gonzalez and Chris Thomason. Hey, welcome back to the Blitz. All right, we already saw some homecoming wins, uh, including Alice in the last block. You had another homecoming game tonight. Well, we like to tease all that stuff. Homecoming wins, I guess. Wink, wink. Let's get the highlights rolling. <laughs> we have Kingsville Bramas at Orange Grove playing the Bulldogs. We, man, I love those jerseys. I just have to get distracted by that. Up first, a nice screen pass to number 26, Ethan Ortiz, for the nice little gain. I mean, maybe I shouldn't say little. That's a decent gain, Good right? Game. I love that. Then up next, we have QB keeper number 10, Cutter Stewart, cutting through the Bramas defense and driving the boat all the way home Chris touchdown Bulldogs and you know what we leave the we leave the camera on him for a little bit because he really he, he owned that yeah this kid one of the better quarterbacks not only in the area but he was in the elite 11 camp in the offseason so he, he earned this camera time Chris then up next Bulldogs go for the two QB short pass number 27 Marshall share easy money success we love that then up next Orange Grove again trying to keep the momentum but there's a button there, Chris. But Kingsville's defense says, no way, Jose. Bulldogs shut down on fourth. Kingsville's pretty happy about this one, but they couldn't really get much going. So up next, QB gets the case of the Butterfingers. I guess I false start. Ashley Spoiler Gonzalez. Alert. Yes, I know. Case of the Butterfingers on uh, snap. Uh, Bulldogs number 36 makes the sack. Let's take a look at that final. Oh, get was, the grass out of your head. It was not there that we go. Great. Help a brother out. Yeah, I know. 0-44. Orange Grove Bulldogs take the dub on homecoming. Gosh, we love winning on homecoming, Chris. All right, let's get to a great rivalry game in Class 3A. George West paying a visit to the Mathis Pirates. Always a great game when these two go at it here. Mathis is Marcus Alvarado hitting Carlos Acosta for the big first down. Pirates in Ooh. business, in goal business, first and goal. Then Andrew Cuellar here, gonna punch it in for the Pirates. This, a, yeah, a great back and forth <laughs> game. Now, George West trying to answer after the Cuellar touchdown, made it 14 all. So we've got ourselves Fair a ball game, game but go. here, the Longhorn's gonna oh. put it on the ground, recovered by Zedric De Leon. So Mathis in business now. Their drive, though, would stall. So it's back over to George West, looking to Snyder. regain the lead here. Jake Snyder, oh, looking like he was going to get popped. Instead, hits Je Jesse Birch for the huge gain. And he's eventually going to get knocked out of bounds, but not before he gets inside the red zone. George West in business. Then here, the Longhorn's going to cap off the drive with a Snyder touchdown now. Oh, Ooh. look at that. He got the ball right back to him. That was spiffy. Now, what was that? I, he got popped out of the running back's hands yeah. right back to Snyder. But George West goes up, but it's Mathis that gets it done in the second half. Final 43-26. Oh. The Pirates win the rivalry game. It looked like it was going to be one of those games where pressure makes diamonds and all, but I yeah. guess not. <laughs> up next, we have a Rams' Pass Panthers at San Diego Plain Vaqueros. Again, this is their first home game because they had the first they had their first few games canceled because of COVID rising within yeah. the district. And they have a brand new beautiful blue turf. Now look at right that there. blue turf. That is beautiful. I Let's love that. See that. We have Colton Garcia with the long run. Yes, blue on blue. Brand new home. We love the that. Boise State vibes out there. Gosh, I love that. Then up next, Lucas Lera Salis with the touchdown. Oh, Ashley Gonzalez, false star. Here we go. <laughs> All the way home. Let's go. For, that's like what? The first home touchdown on the new turf. I bet that felt very, yeah, very, very is. nice. Then up next, we have an inner. Well, you know what? I shouldn't say it yet. I shouldn't say it yet. Look at that. We I got love the that mascot. That's a creepy yeah, looking hey, I, San I, Diego, I love you guys. I love that. Yeah. Then we have an, an interception with San Diego. He said, Give me that ball, and I'm going to take it. I'm going to take it. Let's see if he goes all the way. He sure does, Chris. That is Jason Salinas with the. Oh, no. We got the flag, but that was a touchdown. Definitely got it. Really counted, good. Right? It sure did. It sure did. You know, there's a flag on the play, but we made it. We got it. It counted. It counted. I, I mean, it looked good on camera. It sure way. did. Then up next, AP sacked by Caden Reagan. He said, nah, you ain't getting farther than me. So here we go. You down. Number 15 with the Rams' pass making that sack. Then up next, Rams' pass QB Cameron Kinder making the touchdown. Let's see that. He goes all the way. Zips right through that defense. Ooh, nice. Oh, he got an Astella bye-bye. Oh, man, that's rude on that new turf. <laughs> Golly, let's take a look at that final score, though. 654 San Diego's Vaqueros take the dub on their brand new blue turf at homecoming. We love that. Good Winning win. on homecoming. Yep, good win for San Diego. How about the Skidmore Time and Bobcats? Ooh. Unbeaten on the year. 
taking on Senator Trudis coming in two and one. Good battle of 3A schools here as well. Here, opening kickoff for Senator Trudis and the Lions. Oh, Ooh. gonna get wrapped up. That Skidmore defense swarming. Ooh, just purple on white. On white. Then here, watch as this is gonna get. It's going to be a good play, but it's kind of the story, the, the theme of the night. We've seen oh. all kinds of yellow, right? So don't get too excited. He takes it to the house, <laughs> but it's going to get called back. Golly, all the Skidmore Chris. coaches, they can't believe it. Now here, oh. and it's a bad snap by Skidmore Tynan. It's Senator Trudis, Tony Benitez that recovers. Lions in business. Now Skidmore here with the ball. Sonny Man going to roll out and he picks up the first down. Bobcats in business. Yeah, we got, we're getting some offense. We're, we're getting it going. There Took we a go. little bit, we're getting it going. <laughs> then the handoff to Jacob Torres here. He's going to rumble in Ooh. for the score. Oh, yeah. Bobcats getting the, getting the TD on the home field tonight. Let's take a look That's at the final in this 3A matchup. That was the only oh. score of the night this, seven to six this, the final this was the game to be at chris this was that close game that we we're waiting for yeah However, if you're a big fan of defenses while. that was the game to be at you know we've seen so many 60 point games and 50 <laughs> point games you don't know what to do when you get a seven to six game we can't have it all chris it's either a <laughs> blowout or barely barely a football game but nonetheless football on football we love that Yep, exactly. All right, well, coming up, we've got the play of the week, and the Santa Gertrudis Band is going to give you all your scores, so that's after the break.